Yo, I'm back again, and today we're doing a Hoffenheim play rating. Shout out Gigi Anderson. All right, so um, professional status, obviously the professional. I don't know why I keep on reading that one. That one's just not needed, bruv. Um, nickname, no nickname today. Um, owner status, love the club. Um, they're in the Euro Cup. I don't know if they're still in there. I have no clue. Now history, they might not come in from the bottom still. Um, I don't, I, I don't even know how to pronounce that, bruv. Um, they might not come in that regional thing into Bundesliga 2 to the Bundesliga they came into the Bundesliga in 2007 and 8 breath so they they they're, they're kind of recent still um highest they finish is what third it's not that bad you get me close to winning it bruv last year they finished sixth so they're definitely like up there like that's why they predicted to finish seventh bruv they're up there still so yeah <clears throat> man like man like Hoffenheim let's see what their squad's saying cool so we're going from Philip Pentke all the way to Munas Dabur, bruv, cool. Philip Pentke. All right, he's 35 years of age. Backup goalkeeper, bruv. All right, now he's got 12 agility, 15 reflexes, and 13 one on one. So the reflexes are good. The one on ones are under average. The agility is shocking. Th those are the three things that I look for for a goalkeeper, especially on a goalkeeper defender. That's my favorite role because they're not rushing out. They're standing and they're defending on their line. So so it's no none of that bullshit, bruv. And and to be fair, he's, he's kind of rubbish. Still can't lie to you. Like let's be real. What do you see apart from the fact that you can jump high? Can't you can't even reach, bruv. What's the point if you can jump and you can't reach, bruv? Don't make sense to me, bruv. So, man, like Philip Bent Pentake, bruv. Dead food, bruv. Can't let you say. Cool. Next, Oliver Bauman. All right, all right. <laughs> oh shit. All right. So this guy, sweeper keeper support, strip him of that role. I, I don't give a shit if he has six new rushing out tenders. Yeah, I don't care, bruv. Like, fam, fourteen agility. 16 reflexes, 16 one ones Are you mad, bruv? That that goalkeeping pivot is amazing, bruv. I can't lie, he's amazing. 17 teamwork, 16 anticipation. Fam, he's cold, bruv. And he's six foot two as well. What's a jump in 13? Air reach 10. The only thing I can say about him is that in the corners, he's vulnerable. Can't lie to you. So I might have to reach out my statement about him standing on the line, bruv, because he's probably more vulnerable standing on the line. If he rushes out, um, someone like this would probably close the angle better because he has rushing out tendency of 16. Um, because of that, it's probably better that you do that still. You don't don't listen to me on that one. Put him on super keeper still, can't lie to you, because the, the angles from when, when he's got dead jumper reach and aerial reach, definitely get impacted in the corners, bruv, if he stands on the line. So yeah, make him rush out and he's looking quality still. That's their number one, and that's and that's Oliver Bauman, bruv. Now now the outfield players, bruv. Cool. Next, Steven Posh, bruv. Alright. Twenty three years of age, fifteen pace for a centre back, yeah? Fifteen pace, sixteen composure. 13 agility, 13 acceleration, and 14 tackling. Fam, physically, he's he's looking good in terms of movement. In terms of strength, it's a bit it's a bit under average still. But he is tw he's 23, so that's definitely a good good um like because he just came from the youth rank. He's definitely learning his lessons still. Now, 11 technique, nine vision, 12 passing. Can't see what he's doing. Technically poor, but he's got a little bit of execution on his pass. I can lie. First touch is bouncing all over the place, bruv. Peak fam, like that that first touch is shocking still, but. He's a defender. Like not all of them are meant to have silky first touches, bruv. And he, he can do what his job is. Like the, the job of a defender is to defend and he can do that. He's got he's twenty three and he's got fourteen tackling, bruv. Well, you can't ask for more, bruv. It's literally the, the the bare minimum. And he's got it, bruv. So and, and he's composed as well. This guy is a quality defender. Man like Stephen Posh, bruv. Like he's cold still. Cool. Alright. <clears throat> Next, I mean Bikakic, bruv. Bikakic. Cool, 30 years of age, no nonsense centre back. And yeah, I, I can see what they mean still. So, eight agility breath. However, he's got 16 pace though. Meaning, every time he steps out, he gets absolutely fucked, bruv. However, when he spins around in about 15 years of that eight agility, he's catching man with that 16 pace. Are you mad, bruv? He's catching him. And and either footed as well. The tackling, he's going to make that last ditch tackle and it's, it's going to be successful. 16 tackling is amazing, bruv. I can't lie to you, it's amazing still. Like fam, that, that's an amazing, amazing tackling rate. 18 bravery, don't fear no one but the Lord himself, bruv. Determined, determined to do what he does to you as well. He's cold, bruv. I can't lie. In terms of what he does, in terms of like the destroyer, the dirty side, the, the, the enjoying the defending bit, he's cold and he's even got 17 strength. So it's not even a barge. Like you can't even barge, man. Because cause, cause, cause when you try and barge him, he's just putting you on the floor, bruv. You can't, you can't do nothing, bruv. So man like Bika Kitch, bruv. He's looking like a quality destroyer of a centre back, bruv. But however, when the ball's at his feet, it's a myth, bruv. Can't lie to you. Mythical. Eight technique, seven vision, nine passing. Don't even attempt to play out from the back if you have this guy in your team, bruv. Can't lie to you. It's, it's, it's looking very, very peak if you try and play out from the back with this guy. Because, fam, 
that that pivot for 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 centre back can't lie, it's very dead, bruv. But anyway, he, he's cold though for what he does. So cool. All right, next. Um, and and it's always good to have um, what's the word? Balance as well. Like it, it it's not all the time just two ball playing defenders. Can't lie, to you you do need like balance, bruv. Like one destroyer, one ball player. You do need that still. Cool. Next, Kasim Adams, bruv. <clears throat> All right, we'll play in defender or defend. Cool, strip him of that role. He's got dead. Piv- he's got a dead pivot, bro. He's not a ball playing defender. I mean, he's very good. He's very composed. But the pivot is ten technique, eleven vision, eleven passing, and it's not like he's gonna get any better, bro. Like he's twenty five, bro. So it's not gonna get any better still. Now, fifteen pace, ten agility. So once again, all it means is that when he steps out, he's gonna get absolutely fucked, bruv. But he's gonna he's gonna turn around in about ten ten years. You get me? Cause cause the agility is dead, bruv. He's gonna turn around in about ten years, and he'll make that last ditch tackle. He's got forty tackling. It's it's baseline. I can't lie. It's baseline, but it's still baseline. It's still good though. It's still like you know, it's it's the bare minimum. So like I said, he's composed. He's like an S seventeen jump reach, very good, but twelve heading. So it's more like a clearance thing. When when the heading is good. It means it's like a, a aerial threat thing, but when it's heading, when the heading's bad, the jump reach is good. All it is is a clearance thing. So yeah, um, and and he's strong as well. I don't take that, strip that trait off him. He's he's got a dead pivot. You don't want him to bring the ball out of defense, bro. I rather him hoof it still. So yeah, Kasim Adams, he's, he's decent though for, for what he does. I probably put him no nonsense still. Yeah, cool. I like Kasim Adams, bro. <clears throat> cool. Next, Benjamin Hubner. All right. Central defender. Um, now, once again, um, eight agility, ten acceleration. So he's not moving like he's not in it. But twelve pace as well. So it's not even a recovery thing either. However, if it's a stationary thing, what's the position? Fifteen. Yeah, he, he's standing there, still waiting for man to come to them. I mean, come to him. He's got sixteen tackling. Very good, bruv. Can't lie to you. Um, it, what sixteen anticipation? Yeah, mentally he's very good. Still determined, brave anticipations there yeah he, he's mentally like he's levels above still one of those guys he, i would say he's got a cool head but he doesn't he's got 12 composure bruv so that one's out the window however like i said for what he can do is the no nonsense thing don't put himself to the vendor no nonsense on defend bruv because he's literally there to win the ball like you can see he's, he's tailor-made for that marking 16 tackling 16 strength 16 he he wants to win the ball positioning 16 15 bruv like fam He's a ball winner, innit? He's not no central defender, bruv. Like, put him on ball winning or no nonsense centre back, bruv. That's all he is, still. He can even step out and play CDM. That's definitely on the destroyer thing. Definitely, bruv. So, yeah, for this Benjamin Hoopner guy, put him, like, on no nonsense, still. Cool. All right. <clears throat> Next, Kevin. Kevin Akboguma. A- Akboguma, yeah, yeah, Akboguma. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Um,. Another centre back, but this time um, the movement is very good again. Um, wow, wow, sixteen pace, fourteen acceleration, bruv. The movement is mad. I can't lie, and the strength as well. Like physically, he's amazing. Physically, he is amazing, bruv. Like he is an like, athlete in it. Like that's the modern day centre back right there. Now, does he does he enjoy the dirty sides? Kind of. You get me. Fourteen tackling his baseline, like I said, that's the bare minimum, and he can do it, bruv. So as long as, can, as long as he can win the ball, I ain't got a problem still. Now. 11 technique, 9 vision, 12 pass in the pivot. You can't see what he's doing. Barely any technique, but he has he has got a bit of execution still. Can't lie to you. Composure, out of the window, bruv. Shocking. Shocking composure. However, um, it's looking like a recovery thing still. If you put this guy... I'm thinking you could do many different partnerships here. Can't lie to you. Um, I, I do have to um, show you, man, what I'm doing after. I will do that still. Um, cool. But anyway, there, there's many different partnerships here because there's many different destroyers and there's many different ball playing defenders, bruv. So... It's gonna it's gonna be very interesting still, man. Like Kevin Akpoguma, bruv. He's just another one of those no nonsense recovery things that last ditch tackles and that. That's what it is still. So yeah, man. Like Kevin Akpoguma still. Look at wait wait wait. What's it like in the air? Yeah, it's another clearance thing because he can't direct his headers. He can just win them and clear them. Cool. All right. <clears throat> wow. All right. Next, Pavel Kadabek. Kadarabek. All right, um, 28 years of age, fullback on attack, bruv. Okay, now, um, 16 pace, very good, and 14 acceleration as well. So, in terms of movement, in terms of speed, not movement, because he's got 11 agility, so the, the movement is dead, bruv, but, but the speed is very good, though. So, and, oh, uh, yeah, physically, he's good. Apart from the, the, the <clears throat> apart from the jump reach and the agility, the, the physicals are cold, so I can't lie to you. So, it's, it's definitely, uh, I'm thinking fullback attack, that's probably the best thing for him. Like, just in a straight line, because you know, you know, I'm gonna have to say complete wing back attack still. I can't lie to you because 
Defensively, I don't want to see that. Like, eight composure. 13 tackling is under average as well. I, I don't want to see that defensively, bruv. He's going to get absolutely skinned, bruv. And the 11 agility as well. He's going to get fucked, bruv. I, I don't want to see that, fam. So, so I'd rather have him higher up the pitch, bruv. Get, get a little centre back on cover to, to, to cover him, bruv. You get me? So, um, yeah, for, for what I'll do with this guy, full back attack. Just let him drive. Um, he's got 13, 13, 13 crossing as well. Like, he can't really dribble, but he can cross in it, kind of. So, yeah, it is under average, but you're going to have to do a bit anyway. So, yeah, looking like an early cross thing because the dribbling is dead. Can't really beat a man with 10 for their either. Yeah, it's looking like a crossing thing still. And and defensively shocking. Complete wing with attack. That's what he has to be still. Cool. Cool. And he knocks ball past the opponent. Taylor made for it, bruv. Cool. All right, next. Um, is it is it Sebastian Rudy, bruv? It is. It is. Um, he's on loan. I always save loan loan deals, yeah? Would I make the loan with permanent now? <clears throat> 30 years of age, deep plan playmaker on defense now. Um, 14 technique, 13 vision, 15 passing. He's got execution on the on the on the pivot. You get me, he does, and he's very technical as well. You just can't really see what he's doing, so it's not like a, a long pass thing. It's it's more of a, a short control thing. Can't lie to you. Nothing wrong with that, but if you're if you're trying to like build up from that position very quickly, he's not your guy still. But anyway, he can slightly win the ball. He's not one of those workhorses that are going to run around. He's more of a guy that's going to stay in his position. As you can see, he hasn't got the off the ball. He's got the positioning. As you can see, that bruv. Now, twelve pace, full in agility, and twelve acceleration. All that means. He's moving, but but just not at speed, bruv. So it's one of those ones. He's he's literally he's floating, he's gliding, bruv. That's it. And and if he's got a good first touch, which he does, yeah, he's just gonna be gliding, picking up the ball, and and just distributing it quickly. That's all he's gonna be doing, bruv. And he's got good composure as well. So for me, I can't lie. He's looking like a neat and tidy player. I can't lie to you. He's looking like a neat and tidy one still. Like nothing really flashy. Just just get get the job done. Short passes. Short, complete, but he's going to have a mad park pass accuracy then. I'm thinking about it now still. Composure, decisions, anticipation. He's looking good still, man. Like Sebastian Rudy. I would make the loan with permanent. I can't lie, I would still. And like Rudy still. Safe. All right. Next, um, Havard Nod Viet. Um, defensive midfielder on defend, brav. Okay. Um, <clears throat> um, uh, and he can play centre back as well. Okay, now. Um, they're saying it's either a CDM or a centre back thing. I'll decide. I'll decide. Um, nine agility, ten acceleration. So he's clearly a, a one of those CDMs that are just gonna sit and invite pressure on him. But, but, why would you invite pressure if you can barely win the ball? You're just gonna. You're just bending. You're literally just bending over. Why would you do that, bro? I, I don't understand why you would do that because he's he's not even like it's not it's not even like he's mad physically dominant. Forty strength of his baseline. It's not. It's not like he's out of this world strong. It's not like he's out of this world in terms of tackling either. Like, what's his best at? Teamwork? <laughs> Long throws, bruv? This guy's rubbish, but I can't lie, he's rubbish. I can't lie. I'm, I'm struggling to see why I'll play him. I, can't, I genuinely can't lie to you. Like, he, he, he works hard, and that's about it, bruv. He, he concentrates. Yeah, I can't lie. If, if you want teamwork, like, bit of morale and that, keep him in the team. But for me, in terms of, like, I like to play on the pitch, and it can't lie to you. I don't know about you, man. I don't think we play in the dressing room still, so... Um, I like to play on the pitch. I'm gonna have to put him in the bin. Still can't lie to you, man. Like have a noise bit. Goodbye, bruv. Goodbye. Stay safe, bruv. Safe. All right. Cool. Next, um, who's that? Kevin Vot, bruv. Let me just scroll down. Yeah, Kevin Vot, bruv. All right. 28 years of age. Another ball playing defender. Okay. Um, these men have got bare defenders, but this time, he's got 18 pace, bruv. My goodness me. Wow. That that pace is mad, bruv. For a centre back, he's booming but it's only a recovery thing because as you're seeing i have to say that same thing again he tries to step out on a little bad man thing gets fucked turns around in about 15 years with that dead agility and just cl clumps man bruv but this time he's got 13 tackling so it's, it's looking a bit peak still like, i can't lie to you it's very very, very under average tackling but like i said it's, it's, it's a recovery thing physically in terms of movement in terms of speed not movement he's good still 16 strength as well side to side in terms of not barging thing he's got man still um 15 composure, very good. 14 passing, very good as well. So there's definitely good things there, but like the tackling, which is probably the main thing for a centre back, he hasn't got it still. So it is definitely a vulnerability in terms of like him winning the ball. And it's not like it's going to get better. It's funny, it's probably going to go down, bro. So yeah, Kevin Vaught, just just be a might be be wary in it. Like, and, and 11 heading as well. Yeah, be wary that he he can get fucked, bro. He can. Cool, man. Like Kevin Vaught. <clears throat> Next, Robert Scov, bro. 
this name rings a bell. It, name, it rings a bell still. It rings a bell. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I saw that badge in my head still. I did, I did, I did. Cool. Man like, man like Scov, bruv. Let's see what he's saying. All right. Um, 12. Okay, he's, he's, a, he's an inverted winger on the right-hand side now. Let's see what he's saying, bruv. Now, I can clearly see that he's one of those wingers that aren't fast. And what I always look at, if you're not fast, is your pivot. And he's got a decent one. Can't lie to you. He's 24. He's got a decent pivot, bruv. And I, and I always use that ZH comparison as well because that's the one player that always comes to my head with a slow winger that's got a good pivot, bruv. Can't lie to you. It's the only one. Um, it's not the only one, but it's the first one that comes to my head. So it's the one that I'm always using it. And everyone knows who he is as well, so it's an easy one. So it's, it's one of those ones where you're just going to cut inside, look for the diagonal to the back post, bruv. That's all it is every single time. That's the way it has to be. 15 composure, you get me. 12 dribbling. It's not like he's going to try and drive his way through everyone. You can't even fucking dribble in, in tight spaces, bruv. You can't. Um, he's 6 foot 1 as well. Yeah, you can't. He, he's, he's more of that. Um, wide playmaker like um, you can put him on advanced playmaker or inverted winger I, I'll probably still do inverted winger because he's got very good finishing he can go to the box and score and when he gets into a dangerous area he's got 16 long shots so it's looking mad fam can't lie to you um, for me he's, he's a decent player still no he, he's, a, he's a very good player for his age he's actually very good for what for what he does like if you know what he does if you know how to get the best out of him he'll do a job for you still like he will win it like just tell him cut inside like, tell him dribble less as well. You, there's no point telling him to dribble. He's got total dribbling. If, like, like I said, if a, ta- if a um, defender's got higher um, tackling than you're dribbling, more time is going to pocket you. So you might as well just tell him dribble less. Just tell him go in the box, float around, cut inside, whip it. Like, first time, cross early as well. Off the ball, 16. He's even got a strike. He's got a, he's got a shout at striker, a little false 19. Uh, and another play that I, com- um, what's it called? Another play that I compare him to is fucking Martial. Obviously, Martial's not doing well right now, but, only false nine that I can think of right now. I can't lie to you. Um, yeah, just let him do a little striker thing. That's that's if you want to do. It. I, I, you know, personally, I wouldn't do that. Still, I'll, I'll make him come out wide. Can't lie to you. Yeah, because he can't really dribble. Yeah, um, Robert Skov. He's he's a good player though. He's a good player, bro. Man like Robert Skov. Cool. All right. Next, Ryan Sessignon. Wow. Um. Oh yeah, he did come here. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> just one of those wingers, man. Just one of those wingers, like. 10 dribbling really there's no way his dribbling is that bad it can't be it cannot be that bad man you're a winger and you've got 10 dribbling I get that you're 20 I get that but the one thing that I was looking for you to have you don't even have it bro that's the one thing because I saw the movement it was looking decent still I saw that he had decent pace and, and agility as well stamina very good but then I'm, I'm looking at the dribbling I'm like what are you doing bro like you, you can't even pick up the ball and drive effectively you can only pick up the ball and carry it but that can only get you so far because when you get pressed now you're just going to lose the ball immediately. No, no fight, nothing, nothing said, bruv, because the ball's meant to be sticking to your feet. You know, you know, new, new, new fucking, what, what's the word? I don't even know what it's called, bruv, but, um, I, I, I don't know what it's called, but new um, saying, yeah, new saying, dribbling is how much the ball sticks to your feet. As you can see, man's got fucking Tim balloons on, bruv. Like, no, no, no little um, fucking PVA glue, bruv. Like, Tim balloons, bruv. No, no stick at all. It's gone, bruv. The ball, every time he takes the first touch, you can see 10, gone. Turns into a through ball every single time. Shocking. So, for me, I can't lie. He's looking very, very rubbish, bruv. I have to be real. I have to be real. He's looking very, very rubbish. Like, he's 20, I get that. But pace can only get you so far. And if he's out wide, I'm looking for someone that can kind of, like, at least have a pivot or something. He ain't even got that. It's dead food, bruv. It's rubbish. Safe. Cool. Man like Ryan Sessinio. Cool. Next, Costa Stafilis. Staf- Staffil this bruv. Cool. Um <clears throat> cool. Alright, um full back attack or wing back attack. Now he's got sixteen tackling flipping now. Alright, so he's definitely looking like one of those guys that aren't like moving at all. Like he's he's you know what, you know what? Take that attack thing off him. He's got fourteen crossing. It's not there's nothing that you're really missing if you've got sixteen tackling, bruv. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, man. I'm gonna have to make him no nonsense still. I'd rather, because like the dribbling isn't really there, pace isn't really there as well. It's not like he's going to get up, yeah, and then come back immediately. Like, it's going to take him a while still. He's not really that fast. So I'd rather just tell him, you know what? No point passing the halfway line. Just wait for them to come to you. Even tell him press less urgently. And when it comes to, like, your tackles and that, you, you know how there's, like, tackle harder and ease off tackle? Tell him ease off tackles as well. Because that's how you manage to pinpoint the tackles. And he's got the very good um, tackling to do that effectively. So, for me, I can't lie. Man's going to have to tell him, don't pass the halfway line. Wait for them to come to you. Win the ball. And because you've got a decent pivot, 12 technique, 12 and you're fighting passing, you can come inside or you can 
cross from deep if, if you get actually you can't even cross from deep you know you, you can do it if you probably probably will pass the halfway line but yeah tell him cross from deep if he does yeah that's that's where it is still um that's the way i see it working personally shoots with power long shots 14 i mean 16 yeah 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 yeah, yeah. no nonsense fullback for this guy's my, my cup of tea still yeah cool all right next <clears throat> joshua brennett um okay okay cool cool wing back attack all right 17 pace very good pace 15 is elevation as well so he's moving at speed just not side to side though and he's 26 as well so it's not really going to improve that quickly it could though like it could because he's 26 he's only two years away but yeah um it's not really going to improve let's be real let's be real honesty cool now 11 composure um it's, it's looking peak still um I'm, I'm already seeing with this guy it's one of those ones once again where you're gonna have to tell him Listen, you're basically a winger playing deep. That's all you are. Because defensively, you're going to you're gonna get screwed, mate. You're going to get absolutely screwed, bruv. I, I don't want to see that on live TV, bruv. I don't want to see that, bruv. Man, man, man's just going to get screwed, fam. So, yeah, complete wing back on attack, bruv. As you can see, he's got decent dribbling and decent crossing. They're both under average, but it's only by once. It's not, it's not, it's not the end of the world, bruv. So, yeah, decent work rate as well. But as you can see, the reason why I say what I said because I always say with, say with what say what I say with, with reasoning, bruv. Not without weird reasoning. Say it with reasoning. He's got a dead pivot. Can't tackle. Composure shocking. And the agility shocking as well. I don't want to see a, a, a nibbity wing. I don't want to see a Lee Ray Sane buck him on the wing, bruv. If I, if I see that, it's peak, you know. Because that peak can only get you so far. My man's got 19, you've got 17. You're fast, but you'll still gap you. Safe. Anyway, that's not even a fair comparison. I can't compare like, this guy to Sane. But I'm just saying that that's just an example of a winger that will just absolutely tear him apart safe so yeah um complete wing back thing get someone to cover him just do your your job like in terms of like picking up the ball driving and and that's what it's gonna have to be still so yeah straight line thing as well because obviously no agility no agility bruv so yeah joshua bennett bruv cool all right next um dia de samis <laughs> fuck it out all right <clears throat> um ball in the midfielder okay okay you know what 15 agility, cool, he's 24, just escaped the youth bracket as well, there's definitely stuff that he's learned, that's what I always like to see, I love to see someone that's le just left the youth bracket and learned something fam, as you can see, agility is very good, pace not there, there's exhilaration there, so he's not fast, but he's moving in it, so very good to see, anticipation, aggression, mad, work rate, mad, he's a destroyer, I, I see it already, I, that's, that's the thing about doing so many player rating cards, I can just see what they are immediately bruv, just like that bruv, man can just see what they are, this guy's a fucking destroyer bruv, and He's got mad execution on his pass as well. Like fam, 13 technique, 14 vision, 16 passing. Are you flipping? Are you deluded, bruv? Are you, are you deluded, bruv? Like fam, 14 vision, 16 passing. Like fam, and he's winging the ball as well. Box to box is going to be a dream. I can't lie, that'll be a dream. Because the tackling and the passing is the same. He works hard. Anticipation mad, aggression mad, stamina mad. Fam, Box to box would be a dream. I can't lie. Like for someone like this, I probably don't even want him to sit. I want him to run around. I can't lie. He's looking amazing for a box to box because both things that you need, he's got them in sixteens, bruv. You get me? Madness. Mad box to box midfielder. Strip him of that ball in the midfielder role. Not saying that he can't do it. I'm saying that he's better suited to a box to box thing. Safe. Quality. Quality. Man like Diado Summers. <laughs> looking good still. Safe, bruv. Cool. Next. Florian <laughs> Hey, I don't even know what. Hey, madness, madness. No, no, no disrespect. Obviously, I just can't pronounce that, bruv. I just can't, fam. But anyway, anyway, I right, let me let me cool. Advanced playmaker 14 technique, 14 vision, and 15 passing. Very good pivot. And he's 25 as well. Very good. And he's got good composure as well. Very, very good, bruv. The pace amazing in that midfield. 14 agility as well so he's moving side to side but it's just going to take him a bit longer to get to that 15 pace not a problem if you're looking for a little counter attack thing because as long as he okay you know you know you know but maybe in a counter attack i would like a bit of acceleration but i'm saying like if he does pick up the ball people are going to think they can stick with him then then it's going to get to that 15 pace and they're just going to leave them behind that's how it has to be and tackling isn't really that good as well it could be an advanced player making be a mazella i wouldn't really put him cam as he's got 13 decisions bruv as you can see the composures are amazing though so yeah First touch, amazing as well. Another one of those neat and tidy midfielders. I mean, neat and tidy midfielders that can do what you ask them in terms of passing. He's tall as well. He's got height, but it's more of a lanky thing because he's got 11 strength, bruv. Not really, not really dominant, bruv. Places, shots, dictates tempo. That's what I want to see. It, it could even be a deep planting. It could, bruv. It could. I, I can definitely see that happening as well. 
Man like Florian Grill, 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 Grillish, you're definitely cold though. He, he is a good midfielder. Can't lie to you. He's very good still. So yeah, he's good still. All right, next, Dennis Gega. All right, 22 years of age. Love, love the youth. Love the youth, bruv. Love the youth. Cool. <clears throat> Sixth in agility. All right, so he's moving side to side, but just not at speed. As you can see, he's got 10 pace and 12 acceleration. So, so that's already out the window. Now, they say deep line playmaker. He already dictates tempo. And I can't lie, 16 composure, very good. Pivot is 15 technique, 13 vision, 14 passing. Now, the first thing that I'll do with this guy in that development section is improve that vision. And then he's looking very dangerous. Then he is, bruv. Can't lie to you. 14 first touch as well. He, he's everything that you need. He's he's one of those simple footballers that are very effective, bruv. That's what I mean. The simple ones are always the most effective because they can do the neat and tidy things, bruv. It's football. It's meant to be a game of chess, not running around heart pie, heart, not fucking... Fucking sleeves rolled up, bruv. Just running around, kick man chins, bruv. Give man split shins. It's not all about that, bruv. You get me? You do need players on the ball, bruv. When when he puts his foot on the ball, I dare you to, I dare you to step in. It's not even like he's got flair. He, he's probably just press resistant, 16 composure. You get me? So, Dennis Kager, he's, he's very, very good, bruv. Can't lie to you. Very good, bruv. You get me? So, definitely going to be a good player in the future as well. He's only 22. Man has to allow him, innit? There's definitely things there that can improve, but that's because he's 22. Safe. Quality player. Cool. Next. Christoph ba Bamgartner, Bamgartner, 21 this time, um, advanced playmaker on support, in, in that cam position, cool, 12 pace, 13 agility, 12 acceleration, so the movement, not there, not compulsory though, obviously, because he's a midfielder, not compulsory, now, 15 technique, amazing, 15 vision, amazing, 12 passing, so the execution is not there, but there's definitely promise, as you can see, all he needs to do is improve the passing a little bit. And if you do develop the pivot altogether, I don't know if you can do that, but if you can, if you can he's looking like he's going to have 16, 16, and then like 14. That's that's a very good pivot, bro. I can't lie, that's a very good pivot. He's only 21 as well. It's definitely possible. It's definitely possible. Like, he's, like I said, he's got good compo. Just the first touch, 14 as well. Another one of those midfielders that, apart from the, the execution this time, can do the basic things, bro. I always love to see that, bro. I like neat and tidy players, bro. You get me? So... And he works hard as well. He's going to give everything. And not only everything, he's got a good... He's, like, he, he can do the, the, the basics as well, apart from passing, really. Like, I can't lie to you. But there's definitely promise there. Like It's a devel it's a development thing, isn't it? So from, from when I can see that there's a development, there's no lost cause here. No lost cause, bruv. Man like Christoph ba Baumgartner, looking like a good player still. Solid, fam. Can't lie. Very solid, fam. Cool. All right, next. Andrej Ka this guy. Ah uh, man, ah uh, man. Um, please don't tell me it's this guy. Um, <clears throat> the name. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, I got it confused with someone else. Can't lie to you. But um, let's see what this guy's saying. No, cool. They tried to put him out wide. I personally would not. I wouldn't really do that. Can't lie to you. I mean, he can dribble. He has got good agility and and that. But for me, if he's a striker, he's a striker in it now. If he is a striker now, um, they say advance forward. I can see that. I can definitely see that. Not getting in behind, but he can definitely pull strings, bruv. Definitely. For a pivot of a striker, that's not that bad either. 15, 10, 8, 14, vision, 13, passing. That's a decent pivot for a striker, innit? So, um, Andrej Kramaric as well. Cool. Work rate, amazing. So, he's not going to stop running. All of the no-nonsense um, centre-backs that came here for UFC instead the football that have got no composure, bruv. It's, it's peak for you, bruv. Because when he's running at you, it's peak, fam. I can't lie. So, and he's either footed as well. With that 15 finishing, wherever foot it lands in, more time is going in the top of the, the top of the net, bruv. Can't let you. Um, 12 composure is not really that great, so he's probably going to sna snatch at his shots. But you play shots so and you've got 15 finishing, always good to see. Going to make it very hard for the keeper. And he's got an amazing first touch as well. Going to take him out the game with the first touch, bruv. Agility moving. Must have off the ball 14. Flair 16. Man, man, I really get him flapped in the penalty area. It's peak, fam. Like, Andrej Kramaric, he's, look, he's looking decent still. I can't lie. Um, the only thing that I'll say about this guy, like, you know, you, even the pivot is, for a striker, like I said, it's, it's a calm one. Like, yeah, um, what, what can I really say? He's a good player. That, yeah, like I said, um, mentally, like, uh, apart from the work rate and the flair and the anticipation, that uh, is kind of, and off the ball as well, and the vision. It's kind of like um, composure is a bit under average, decision is a bit under average as well. But for me, he's got more very, he's got way more goods than he has bad. So Andres Kamerich, he's definitely he's a, he's a good player still. He is a good player. Cool. Oh wait, but before I leave, what's he like in the air? Can't win them, but if he does get them, he's got them safe. Cool. Um, play that one back if you didn't get it. Cool. Next, Jacob Brun Larson. All right. Um, 
21 years of age, inverted winger, um, on, on support this time. Like I always say, if they've got no pace, I always look at the pivot. What is it offering you for the pivot? Not really that much right now. He's 21, not really offering you that much, still can't lie to you. So, um, but this guy, um, uh, it's, it's very confusing now because he's out wide, he's trying to cut inside. He hasn't got the pace to cut inside. He hasn't got a pivot to cut inside and go for a diagonal pass. Like, it's peak. The first touch is 11 as well. My goodness me. I'm going to have to take him from that wing row and put him striker still. I have to be I have to be completely honest with you guys. He's six foot in the air. He's rubbish as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm trying to get the best out of him. I can't lie. I'm trying, to, I'm trying, bruv. But, yeah, he's looking like a pressing, pressing forward, bruv. Pressing forward. What's his off the ball? 16. He's a pressing forward still. Can't lie to you. Pressing forward, they, they say there's no side preference. If you do get a chance, put him pressing forward. So he's only 21. You can still save him. You can save him, innit? Like, the pace isn't there. Acceleration is. I have a foot as well. He will work hard. He's got aggression as well. Cool. Full team finishing, 16 off the ball. So you're, you're trying to mark him, and he's just gone, bruv. Like, his speed's going to be very effective, and he knows where the goal is as well. So for me, and then he's got a decent pivot for a striker now. The first touch is shocking, but you get me? If, if, he, if, he, does, if, he, if he does strike it first time, you're going to have to give him that trait as well. Because you don't want to see that first shot. You might as well just play the game. Tell them, you know, if, you, if you're not going to give him a first, good first touch, yeah, just tell him, shoot first time. You get me? So that way you can't tell me shit. You, get, you know them ones? So, man, like Jacob Brun last night, I'll put him striker. I still can't lie to you. If it's a winger thing, it's not happening for me, personally. But yeah, striker, looking decent still. Cool. All right. <clears throat> Next. Majat Gakinovic. All right, 25 years of age, brav. Cool. Um, Inverted winger on attack this time. This time he's got seven finishing. So why are you on attack, brav? Who are you attacking with your nine composure? Low it, brav. I can't, I can't see that one. I can't see it still. He's right for each other cut in and attack forward, brav. Anyway, the pivot. 13 technique, 12 vision for 12 passing. So it's a bit under average for the pivot. Can't lie to you for a winger anyway. First touch, 15. Um, very good first touch. And he can dribble as well. 14 pace, 17 agility, 16 acceleration. So the movement is there, and he's very good at movement. Flair, 15. So he can. De he's definitely, like in terms of like picking up the ball, doing them tricks and that, I'm looking now. He's literally just a ball carrier. Because if you think about it, if he gets in a box, he's completely useless. If he tries to cut in and do a little ZH thing in terms of the pivot, useless as well. So... The strengths here are his, 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 his agility, his off the ball, the flair, all the things that you need to be a good ball carrier. He's got them. Like, like I said, the dribbling is how much the ball sticks to your feet. For me, he, he, he can definitely do that. But in terms of end product, he's looking like he's just going to be a crosser still. <laughs> and, and, and that's what he has to be. Because he's got dead finishing and nine composure. So pick, he's going he's to have to beat his man, get to the byline and cross it. First time. That's what he has to be still. So yeah. And I think he just joined as well. There's no refund fee here, so yeah, I'm um, just telling bull carrier thing. That's what it has to be still. Cool. Hello. All right, next. Um, Elas Bebu. <laughs> hey, these names are hilarious, bro. All right, let's see what this guy's saying, man. Like Elas Bebu. All right. Wow. Wow. All right, so um, he's, he's a winger, straight line thing, or even a striker, or even a striker. Now, if this guy can make it, I can make it. But I don't give a fuck, fam. Listen, I've got that pace. I don't care. I've got that pace, bruv. And and my technical ability is probably like that as well. I, I can dribble. My finishing dead at my nine composure. Fam, man's basically... This is basically me. This is basically me, bruv. This is basically me. Let me be real now. Um, fam, 14 technique, 10 vision, 11 passing. The pivot is dead food, bruv. And, and 14 dribbling as well. Um, In tight spaces, he's kind of got it. Kind of, you get me. But the flair... Is oh it's fifteen okay cool yeah this is definitely me still man like baby bro. this is me fam cool now eighteen pace bruv fam knocks ball past the opponent as well so once he gets going he's gone safe like I, I've I've experienced it still once he gets going he's gone fam now when it comes to a deep line or someone to have to break down in front of you it is quite peak still I can't lie fourteen technique very good ten vision eleven passing. So, like I said, the pivot is rubbish. 10 finishing, 9 composure. Can't can't shoot from far. Can't can't link play and, and do shit. I can't lie. He's a runner. He's in the wrong sport, bruv. I have to be real. He can just about dribble as well. But, yeah, um, to, to put him strike as a myth, to put him right wing, he can barely cross as well. It's just probably just going to have to be a pace thing on that right-hand side. And, and just, just, just pace, man. And, uh, fuck it. Just pace, man. 
you get me pace man and and beat him you get me you can do that but when it gets to that final ball good luck bruv all you're gonna have to do is look away every single time he beats his man and he's looking to help. when he when he eventually looks up he doesn't look like someone to look up bruv but if he does look up look away you don't even want to know what he's gonna do next bruv because you don't know what he's gonna do next it's peak bruv man like Elas Bebu it's peak bruv it's peak still um it's peak still can't lie to you cool next Sargis Adamian all right um cool um inverted winger on support once again but this time his media description is a striker now um take him from that role but then again if he is an inverted winger he's got 14 pace good 16 16 i mean 16 pace good 14 acceleration so calm 13 agility though so it's not a side to side thing but he's very balanced though so anyway 13 technique 14 vision 12 passing the the pivot he's got very good vision decent technique but the, the no execution is not really good enough still Dribbling is calm. Flair is very good as well. So he can definitely take souls. He can he can definitely do them little feints and that like that I see in football manager. He can definitely do them still. But what I see now, 11 composure, 13 finishing. As a striker, it's looking like you're going to have to give him a lot of service. And then you're just going to have to hope and pray because the 13 finishing is under average. 27 is not going to get any better. It's not going to get any better. Off the ball, 14. He's probably better. Ta- he's tailor-made to play striker still. Like, if you think about it, if you see someone like Werner, like, where it's just pace, yeah, getting behind. Because these men do play a lot of high lines. Still can't lie to you. In this league, there's a lot of high lines. Got the good work rate, the aggression. Decent dribbling. Yeah, just do a little striker in behind thing. I can't lie. I don't see why you should you, you should put someone like this out wide. Yeah, um, I'm thinking for me, I'm going to have to put him striker still. Um, man, like Sargis Adamian. It's looking like a striker. For me anyway. So yeah, um, Sargis Adamian. Cool. All right, next. Isaac Belfodil. All right. Um, <clears throat> okay, he's 28. Cool. 15 technique, 14 vision, 13 passing. So the pivot is, is good, bruv. Can't lie. The pivot is good. 15 pace. Very good. And 16 strength as well. But but he's got 11 agility and 12 acceleration. So I'm, I'm probably going to have to put him target, man. But what's his pivot? Looking decent. Heading. Decent as well. Yeah, I can definitely see him backing into an opponent still. I can see it, bruv. At least six foot three as well. Complete forward. I can see, I can see the logic behind it, but... Because there's no not really movement, I like my complete forwards to move, bruv, because they're meant to be complete, innit? A complete forward isn't complete without movement, can't lie to you. So, for this guy, target man. Um, where's target man support, bruv? Um, that's what it's going to have to be. I, I just want to select it quickly. Yeah, target man support, yeah? Put him on that. And as you can see, suits him much better, bruv. Everything that's been highlighted suits him much better still. Um, yeah, um, he's got the strength, decent pivot. He can, he can dribble, turn his man. Well, not turn his man, but... Dribble and he's got decent flair as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. Target man support. Um, hold up the ball, link. He's gonna. He's looking like a very good linker because he's got flair. He's gonna be very tricky with it as well. And in terms of heading, he's gonna be very good in the air as well. So yeah, target man support. Someone like Giroud, in fact. But this time he's got a bit of pace about him. So yeah, um, Isaac Belfoy deal, bruv. Looking like a decent um link still for for like wingers and that. He'll be a very good link and comes as well. Very very good link, bruv. Cool. He can definitely bully centre backs as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good player still. Cool. Next, Klaus Spreff. Man, like, with the, with the one name thing. Say nine. Cool, let's see what he's saying. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow. Okay, you know, he's 23. You get me? He's 23. Cool, cool. 15 strength. Um, Very good. Jumping reach 16 as well. And heading. So, in the air, he's very good. I have to give him props, bruv. In the air, he's very good, bruv. But now, on the floor, on the, on the floor now, we're, we're like 95% of the game is played, yeah? 11 technique, 10 vision, 10 passing. The pivot is dead, bruv. Composure, very good, but 11 finishing. You're a striker and only a striker. The one thing that you're meant to be good at is finishing. He he can't even do that, bruv. Like, mentally, he's not looking that bad, can't lie to you. Physically, movement-wise, it's looking shocking, bruv. But strength, looking decent. He's looking like someone that you can only play the ball to in the air for him to look half decent, bruv. But when it's on the floor, it's, it's a class, bruv. Like, it's peak, bruv. I can't lie. It's, it's very, very peak. Can't lie. So, um, for this guy... Aerial threat, on the ground, shocking ability. Cool. All right. And finally, Munas Dabo, Rev. Okay. Um, all right. Deep playing forward. Cool. 15 technique, 40 vision, 30 passing. So the pivot is calm. You get me? So it's a calm pivot for a striker anyway. Off the ball. Very, very good. You get me? You can't, can't, you can't mark, man. You can't mark him. Because if you mark him, he's going to just draw your opposition, bruv. So safe. First touch. Very silky. Very, very good. Very, very good first touch. 14 finishing and 14 dribbling. Always good to see. 
very very good composure as well another one of those complete you know yeah co- deep playing forward I can see that happening still definitely see that happening from man like Munas Dabo decent player still man like um, he's, he can literally do everything that you need bruv. Um, he can finish he can dribble um, the, the pivot is calm off the ball he's composed for me he's looking like a very neat and tidy strike and he plays one twos as well just what you need fam so yeah man like man, Munas Dabo he's looking very good bruv can't lie to you so yeah cool all right now let's see how i'll line these men up bruv. but before i do that i'll give these men a 3.5 out of 5 they're looking decent still can't lie they're looking half decent i have to be real they're looking decent still man like man like tsg hoffenheim they're looking decent still so yeah okay, okay so this is something that i was told to do before and i completely just it just left my mind completely but samuel storm asked me to do it again and this is showing you guys how i would line up the team that i just analyzed so I do apologise for whoever asked me before. I apologise, but I'm back now doing it again now. So, man's giving the rating. Now, I'm doing you. I'm showing you how I line up the team. So, I'm doing a 4 2 3 one. I'll go through all the roles. This Bowman guy, because I realised the the, the, the the jumper reaching that is dead food. So, I have to put him on sweeper keeper, bruv. Um, it has to be that still now. I'm I'm putting him, this Kada, Kada Rabbit guy on fullback attack here. Yeah? Because I know that he can do something in the final third, kind of in it. Like the crossing, just tell him cross early and that, that's all you have to do. I have a balance, yeah? Uh, this guy's meant to be a no-nonsense fullback, bruv. No-nonsense fullback on, on defend, yeah? This guy's meant to be on a little cover thing. You get me? So, what I, what I do by this is add a little balance, bruv. Contemplate each other. That's what they have to do still. So, one of them is a young one. I chose the young one still. I chose Stephen Posh. Because I realised, just throw the youth in there. Why not, bruv? Like, he's got he's got an okay um, execution anyway. You get me composed as well, so he's gonna he's gonna pick up the pivot eventually anyway. You get me, and he can slightly win the ball when he's got pace as well for the cover thing. Now this Akpoguma guy, he's just gonna be taking man out, bruv. Like he he's gonna be he's gonna be on the madness still. It's it's either this Akpoguma guy or or this B- Bikakic guy. That's what it has to be still. Probably better suited to be this Bikakic guy anyway. Yeah yeah yeah. It's probably better for this guy still. Yeah. So um, in the left left back position, I chose Stefanie this bruv because I realised. He's probably their best left back. I'm thinking of it now. Um, even though he's not fast, for what you need a left back to have, he's got it still. Um, the composure, he can win the ball, he can cross the ball. Dribbling is not necessary. I mean, yeah, it's not necessary, bruv. Just, just tell him cross early. That's what you have to do to cut, cancel that still. So yeah, in the midfield now, I chose Rudy as a deep plan playmaker on support, not defend, bruv, because I'd rather have him higher up. You get me? Because I know my centre backs are on job, so I, I trust them still. Um, so yeah, he's got the composure, the pivot. He's a lonely as well, so man's definitely making that permanent if I can. You get me? Um, he's not moving, but obviously the pivot is good. It, it speaks for itself. Cool. Now this guy, obviously box to box, he is going to be that guy that if you can't run, he's there. Don't worry, he's there. Don't worry, fam. He's got you still. Like like I said, he's looking amazing. So he's got a very good, very good execution, tackling very good as well, work rate, stamina, everything that you need, anticipation, aggression. Fam bravery, he's got it still. So yeah, box to box midfielder, Sam Sam Isoku, good player still. Now I actually went with this guy in Cam, even though I said I wouldn't. Even though I said I wouldn't, I put him Cam still. Reason being, composed, got a good pivot, bruv. The decisions is what I said I wouldn't do, but I, I have to still. I actually have to. Um, I've got no no choice but to put him Cam. I, I can't lie, he can't dribble, but he's got a good pivot, got a good first touch, decent long shots, bruv. I think he, I think he can do a job there still. I genuinely think he can do a job there at Cam. Who cool. now out wide? I probably said I wouldn't put him out wide as well. However, I'm I'm looking at it now. He's he probably better suited to be out wide than 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 the striker, bruv. I can't lie to you. Probably is, bruv. But then again, it's probably it's his preference, isn't it? And because of the left wingers in this team are shocking, I do want to play with wingers, and I have to put him out wide. I actually have to still. Um, agility, like he can do it. He can do. It. He's got good flair, got good dribbling, first touch. Yeah, works works hard. He he, he definitely can do the wide thing. So yeah, man, like Kramerich, I'm putting him out wide still. Um, this guy targeting man and support back into opponent link play for all the wingers that are cutting inside he will be that guy that they can bounce off in it for for example Skov both of their wingers aren't fast but for what you need them to do they they got it in it like Skov for example he, he's got a very good pivot on him and he knows where the goal is and this guy decent pivot and he knows where the goal is bruv so they'll, they'll be bouncing off this spell for the guy who's got mad strength good in the air and and for me that's, that's a very good team I can't lie I gave them a 3 out of 5 I mean 3.5 out of 5 still like, might have to change that to 3.75. They're, they're, they're actually decent still. So, yeah, man, like, Schalke. It, wait, is it Schalke? Hoffenheim. Hoffenheim. Fuck it up. My apologies, bruv. Hoffenheim. Man, like Hoffenheim still. They're looking decent. So, yeah, you, man, if you like the video, like the video. 
YouTube, um, what's it called, took comments off my last video. I, I don't know why, bruv. I, I think it's probably because I put pain when the title. That's probably the worst play range I've ever done in my life, bruv. You get me? But yeah, um, if you've got any more recommendations, let me know in the comments, bruv. Big up everyone, big up all the, the community, not fans, community, bruv. I don't do fans here, bruv, say. But anyway, if you like the video, like the video. Subscribe to the content you don't expect from me. And I'll see you in my next episode, bruv, safe.